Stem cells are perhaps the greatest breakthrough that medical science has ever known. One cell that can become any tissue type in the human body. One cell that's got the potential to treat every single human disease. University of California at Irvine took very bold steps very early on when stem cells were first discovered. My laboratory decided to take a transformative approach, a little bit of a lateral step to stem cells. We decided to try to make a ultra high purity population of one tissue type in the body from that cell that can become anything in your body. So our group was the first in the world to make ultra high purity spinal cord cell types, in fact a particular type of spinal cord cell type to treat spinal cord injury. Taking transformative steps in science requires a lot more than a good idea. It requires a leadership institute that will support young and innovative ideas and it requires bricks and mortar structures like the Reeve Irvine Research Center led by Christopher Reeve and Joan Irvine, like the Stem Cell Research Center led by the pioneering gift of Sue and Bill Gross. One of the reasons why I came to the University of California at Irvine was this unique mix of academic excellence and industry prowess. This university has a marvelous um, responsiveness to the ideas that are burgeoning and new and novel and innovative. It's been a wonderful environment. I, I felt tremendously supported both with infrastructure, with uh, student support and with ideas. We're making great strides and this first path, this first trip down this lane will pave the way for the subsequent diseases and subsequent applications of stem cells. The University of California at Irvine has built an infrastructure that is attracting the most outstanding stem cell scientists in the world. It's this next generation of scientists and new generation of scientists that are going to make the next breakthroughs, develop the next treatments.